Our motto here is where friends love to reminisce. Gail Stevens owns the Atrium Cafe and Ice Cream Parlor in Port Huron, a historic town full of great sights and great eats. The Victorian-inspired restaurant is filled with time period pieces, assuring you can dine back in time. And we have ladies that'll come in and stay for five hours, you know, just talking. And we wanted the feel of coming in to our restaurant, forgetting about the world out there and the problems that they have and be in a different time period. And a menu to match. Stephen says her desserts are always a big hit, along with their eclectic menu items. She says there's something for everyone. Everything that we have on the menu is homemade. Nothing comes from a bag, a package, or nothing. And if you feel like taking a trip down the street to another unique watering hole, you have to check out the Raven Cafe. It's been described as Hogwarts meets Cheers. Step into an author's dream and grab some coffee or an adult beverage at this hot spot, named after Edgar Allan Poe's classic. Owner Sadat Hossein and his wife Jody Parman tell me the mystical atmosphere draws in folks of all ages. It's very much like an English library with all the books on the shelves, um, and people are always welcome to come in and take them off the shelves. And of course, there's the drinks. We have got a full espresso bar, and that includes the nitro-infused coffee that we recently started doing. We make it all in-house from scratch. And then as far as the beers go, it's all Michigan. We have eight drafts that we rotate and a collection of bottles and cans as well. And we won't put anything on unless it's from Michigan. So if you're up for some sightseeing and unique taverns, Port Huron could be your next stop. In St. Clair County, Ashland Hill, WNEM TV5.